Oh, hey guys, so this is a 10 by 10 pop-up. We already talked about this several times in our, in our videos. And I'll put a link in the description talking about how to set these up. There's a few videos we have on our channel, but today we're gonna talk about weights, how to put weights on these, specifically the sandbag weights. So you can see there's sandbag weights everywhere. And uh, I'll show you how to set these up. So <clears throat> come over here. I'll throw this open really quick. You definitely want weights on these tents because if it's windy, you don't want this flying, you know, if you're at a market, can you imagine this flying, flying off to, <laughs> you know, who, who knows where. So, quickly set it up. We don't have to set up the whole thing. And I'll show you how to put the weights on. This actually normally goes up higher, but for the purposes of this video, we don't really need that. So, first of all, with the weights, we use, I'll come out here where the sun is shining, we use this brand, Impact Instant Canopy, but if you go on Amazon, there are plenty of bags. There's a few different styles. Um, I'm gonna show you how to use this one, but they're all basically the same. It's just a bag that has Velcro on it, so it's pretty much the same. But interestingly enough, what we do with these is A, we fill them with sand. That's what you're supposed to fill them. Make sure it's fine grain sand, okay? Because if it's like gravel or something like that and you fill this with gravel, it's gonna start rubbing the fabric and protruding through eventually and they won't last as long. But furthermore, what we do is we put the sand, we first put a bag in here as a liner, like a garbage bag, and then we fill it with sand. <clears throat> and what does what that does, if, if there's a pinhole in here, like a pinhole hole, <laughs> pinhole hole, then it actually doesn't really leak. So you can have a few holes in there, but if you have this like simple liner, Oddly enough, it really prevents uh, it prevents pinhole leaks. And the thing with the pinhole leak, if this is filled with fine sand, is that it's gonna leak out. Now, obviously, you don't really want that. So, here are the impact weights. You can also find rubber weights as well. Um, we have a few of those, uh, but we actually have a lot of these. They're easy to carry. They have a handle, and you can just grab two, throw it in the truck, grab two, and then you have four weights for a 10 by 10 pop up. But anyways, what do you want to do? Just put it around like that. Velcro it on and you're done. And a couple tips here. The nice thing about these ones is that if you have the big rubber ones, like it might be a little bit of a trip hazard. With these ones, it's nice and tight, close to the leg. And we put it on kind of, if you see here, there's a bit of a um, foot to this leg. And we put the weight like from this side and also we tight this up, we tighten this up as tight as possible, just in case, you know, you, want, you don't want this to be loose. And we store these standing up so that the sand doesn't slowly trickle out between this Velcro. So sand has tendency to wiggle its way through um, all sorts of things, as you know, going to the beach. Um, hopefully one day, Mexico, <laughs> not anytime soon. So uh, that's it, that's as easy as it gets. You just open up the Velcro, Throw it around the leg, uh, make sure it's tight, as tight as it can be, and <clears throat> you are good to go. The tent's weighted down, of course, do all four legs. And uh, that's it, that's how you set up these uh, pop-up tent weights. Again, you can find them all over the place online, on Amazon. Um, the nice, the advantage of buying these online, if you just have one or two tents, is that the shipping cost isn't super high. When you're buying those big, rubber ones, you're paying for the shipping. Here, you're just getting the bag and then you're filling them with sand yourself. So you don't pay as much with shipping. Of course, then you have to fill it with sand, so it adds an extra step. Regardless, they work okay. And again, fill them with a little liner and they'll last much longer, that's what we find. Hope that helps. Take it easy, never give up, see you later.